Hello everyone, this is Dr. Sandeep Manan and we will now discuss about the axillary artery. Let's start. Axillary artery is a continuation of subclavian artery beyond the first rib. It will continue as brachial artery beyond the lower border of teres major and it is divided into three parts by pectoralis minor. Now we have three parts for the axillary artery, first, second and third part and we know that these parts they will give branches like this. First part will give one branch, second part two branches and third part three branches. Now the mnemonic for uh, the branches is salt spa. Now how to use this mnemonic? Let's write the salt spa in this manner where S is written below the first part and A and L T with, uh, is written uh, below the second part. Here T is thoracic which is uh, you, which will be used as common with S, A and L, right? And then we have written SPA here uh, below the third part, right? Now, how to use this? S means superior at T, that is thoracic. It becomes superior thoracic. A is acromio at T, that is thoracic. Then L is lateral at T, that is thoracic. So superior thoracic is a branch from the first part. Acromio thoracic and the lateral thoracic are the branches from the second part. Then we have spa that is what are the branches from the third part we have subscapular artery also we have pacha and acha what is pacha acha it is nothing but posterior and anterior circumflex humeral artery so if we summarize we have these branches from the axillary artery which can be remembered by using the mnemonic salt spa i hope you have understood and you will remember this and uh, now the time has come for the final battle that we have been preparing for never give up no matter how hard the situation is, always believe that something great is going to happen. We have our time Always remember, always tell yourself that this is my time. I'm going to crack this exam this time. Right? Let's rock.